this question we're going to look at ohm's law and how it varies depending on the component you're using so ohm's law says that the current going through an ohmic conductor meaning it follows ohm's law is directly proportional to the potential difference across a component and that only applies provided that the temperature is constant now, if the temperature is constant, that applies. However, in some components, it doesn't. One of the components that doesn't apply in is a filament lamp. Filament lamps are like these old school ones here, where this is the filament. Now, if you pass enough potential difference through it, once you connect it to a circuit, uh, this thing will glow. The reason it glows is because it gets hot. So that's a clue to our um, question down here, which says, explain how the resistance of a filament lamp changes as the potential difference across it increases. So resistance, if you don't know, is basically opposition to current flow. So as the electrons are trying to go through the wire, um, there are these ions in the way that can slow them down. Now, um, if we're explaining how this works, then the idea is as potential difference increases, um, the current increases, and what this does, as the electrons move down the wire, they are more likely to have collisions with the ions in here. So that then causes the temperature uh, to increase. And as that happens, the more tight the temperature of these ions inside the filament means the harder it is for the electrons to go through. So that means then there's less current and there's a higher resistance. Um, so the resistance increases. And that helps explain this graph. Current doesn't keep on increasing forever. Potential difference, it will level off um, because there's an increase in resistance.